I think one of the solutions, the solution that, that seems maybe the best one is to have an AI layer. Um, if you think of like you've got your limbic system, um, your cortex, and then um, a digital layer, sort of a third layer above the cortex um, that um, could work, work well and symbiotically with, with you. I mean, just as your cortex works symbiotically with your limbic system, your di sort of a third digital layer could work symbiotically with the rest. This is something that's in, in surgically inserted or bred so, into the species or what? The, the fundamental limitation is input-output. So uh, we, we already have, uh, we, we're already a cyborg. Um, it's just that, I mean, you have a digital version of yourself or, or partial version of yourself online in the form of your emails and your social media and all the things that you do. Um, and, and you have basically superpowers in, in that with your computer and your phone and, and the applications that are there. Um, you have more power than the President of the United States had 20 years ago. So you can answer any question. Uh, you can video conference with anyone um, right. anywhere. You can send a message to millions of people instantly. Um, you know, you just do incredible things. And, um, but the constraint is, is input out, output. So we're, we're IO bound, um, particularly output bound. I mean, like the, your output level is so low. It's like, particularly on a phone, like your two thumbs are sort of tapping away. Um, this is ridiculously slow. Um, our input is much better because we have a high bandwidth visual interface to the brain. Like our, our eyes take in a lot of, da lot of data. Um, so there's many orders of magnitude difference between um, input and output. Um, so mostly um, effectively merging in a symbiotic way with uh, digital intelligence revolves around eliminating the I.O. constraint. Um, so it's, it'd be some sort of direct cortical interface. Um, and you called it a neural lace? Neur neural lace, yeah. Um, it's totally not Google Glass, right? No, I, I'm talking about no, something but it's which... No, like you wear it? Or you... No, I mean, it would be... Uh, I, mean, it, I mean, there are a few ways to approach this, but some sort of interface directly with your cortical neurons particularly. But doesn't that imply uh, surgical insertion? Not or? necessarily. You could go through the veins and arteries because that, that provides a, a complete uh, roadway to um, all of your neurons. Your neurons are very heavy users of energy, so they need high blood flow. So you automatically, with your veins and arteries, have um, a road network to your neurons. Still so, some kind of surgery, right? Um, yes, but it, you could insert something, you know, basically, you know, in, 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 into the jugular and, and have, <laughs> it gets macabre, but It sounds I mean, really easy and it, it doesn't involve, pop, it, doesn't, it doesn't involve, you know, like chopping your, your, your skull off or anything like that. That's yeah. good. Yeah. But, and plus you're not a house cat anymore, right? Not a house cat. So, right. um, I mean, essentially if, if we can figure out how to establish a high bandwidth neural interface. With ourselves. With, with your digital self effectively. Um, then, uh, then you're no longer a house cat. You know? All right. On and, that and, note. No, on that note. And wait, 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 I, just one closing thing. I mean, I think that's probably. Are you? In, are outcome. you interested? That's probably the best outcome, I think. Are you interested in exploring this possibility that you have just laid? So, in? Somebody's got to do it. <laughs> I'm not saying that I will, but I'm, somebody's got to do it. I mean, I, I, I mean, I, so somebody should do it, and I mean, if somebody doesn't do it, then I, then I think I should probably do it. But, uh, and and the goal of this is to prevent there being an external uh, AI, particularly one controlled by a small group of people that could, yeah, be so much more powerful and intelligent than we are that the house. It would be, it would be godlike in situation. In yeah. Well, this has been really cheerful. Thank you. Yeah.